While we could build this book manually, let's use Autoflow to do the work for us. Motif analyzes your images for overall quality, print resolution, familiar faces, duplicate images, and more, helping you find your best images. Based on this analysis, we make a recommendation, which you can see here. To accept our recommendation, simply click Continue, or you can adjust how many pages are in your book, how many images are used, or how much you want to spend. In this example, we want most of the images in the album, but there were some alternate shots that might be nice to weed out. So let's adjust the image count up to 64. There we go. Click Continue and see what happens. This is Motif's page view. This is the main view in which you edit your book, add and arrange images on the pages, place text, and more. At the bottom of the screen is your image tray. It contains all of the images in your project. Images used or placed in the book have a check mark. You can hover over any image to see an enlargement. Scroll the tray horizontally to see the rest of the images in your project. As we scroll through our images, we can see that some alternate takes, nearly identical to each other, were not placed. We can also filter the contents of the image tray. Right now, all photos are shown, but we could also choose to show only the placed images, the unplaced images, or again, all photos.